Howdy, this is Bob Barker, your RV guy extraordinaire. I'm hanging out here in Valley View, Texas this morning with my new friends at El Dorado RV and Marine. Just happened to be driving by this place the other day. I thought, hey, you know, they got RVs. They brought one I have shared with my followers. Anyway, we're going to check out an Admiral Shorty class a motor home it's my holiday rambler two slide bad boy perfect for your family of six already outfitted with slide or awning anyway already outfitted with awning slides easy for me to say keeps the dirt and debris off the top of your slide lots of storage underneath for all your camping supplies and those necessities of life you just have to have Fully self-contained with holding tanks for fresh sand wastewater, 12 volt power supply, two-way power appliances. Man, what all that means is you can take this thing and go set up camp wherever you want and be totally comfortable. Already outfitted with a rear view camera so you can see what's going on behind you. And a hitch for your toad, whether that's a horse trailer, dog trailer, boat trailer, whatever you're pulling, man, you're ready to go. All kinds of storage underneath. Just check this out. Whoop, that's the house batteries. Lots of battery power there. See, lots of storage space. Get all that stuff and pack it away. Make mama happy. You got a great big awning for your party on the patio. Play. Man, that's what it's all about, going out in the middle of the national forest and sliding out that awning and having an adult beverage and just relaxing away from all of the chaos of the modern world. Ha, you like the way I said that? I did. We have sleeping for six folks. Anyway, we'll start up here in the front. Check it out the driver and the passenger seats pivot. So you have two additional seats in the living area. And when you're ready to roll on down the road, you spin it around and get in there and drive, man. There we go. I think there's actually a desk space there. Yep, you can put a little laptop or a pad on that. 18,000 miles, that ain't too bad. Got a also comfortable sofa that converts into a bed for two. It'll seat three and sleep two. Booth dinette, perfect for feeding your family of six or converting it into a bed and having sleeping for two. There's also ample storage under both benches for your fishing gear. You know, that's what I like to do with my bench seat. Little pantry space right here. Put your salt and pepper in there out of sight. Hey, when I was first, when I was walking through before the video, I was looking at this. You can put all kinds of towels and stuff in here. Or if your woman is like my woman, you can put a washer dryer in there. Mama just got to have the washer dryer. I don't understand why we have to have clean clothes. What's wrong with my dirty, smelly clothes? Two hanging closets in here give you all kinds of space to get your stuff put out of sight. Actually, you could probably put a washer dryer combo unit in that. Anyway, place for Mama to sit and put on her makeup. Or you can flip it open and you got a window. Also oh, comfortable queen size master. Make sure you get a good night's rest no matter where you stop and set up camp. Whether you're boondocking in the Walmart parking lot or set up at a national campground. And nothing more disturbing than Bob Barker staring at you out the vanity mirror. No more late night hikes down to the public facilities and you don't have to stand in line to get your shower. You got all of your own facilities right here with you most important sir yes sir the truck they're trying to get the dog. well hey that concludes our tour of this fantastic family friendly class a motorhome by holiday rambler if you like what i've done hey give me a thumbs up if you thought it could use some improvement hey give me a thumbs down i'm, I'm good either way yeah, I would really appreciate it if you click on that subscribe button down there and help me get to 4,000 subscribers. The more subscribers I have, the more videos I will do. You know, some people might think that's a bad thing. <laughs> anyway, hey, I appreciate you guys watching. Stay tuned for the next.